Hello, this is Mr. Leapforth. And Aaron. <laughs> and we're going to show you how to take the antiderivative of tan x. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Are you nervous? I'm nervous. A little bit. This is going out to the world. Fantastic. How would you rewrite tangent? I would write it as sine x over cosine x. And rem remember, everybody out there in the universe who's going to be watching this needs it to be nice and loud because they can always turn their volume down, but they, it's hard to turn it up when, you know. We're good? He's looking at me like I'm crazy. We should do the webcam so you can see it. That's all right. <laughs> all right. Um, <laughs> do you smell that? So oh, yeah. Chain rule. It smells like the chain rule. It does <laughs> smell like the chain rule, right? So you fumbled around a little bit. What did you finally pick as your W? Uh, cosine x. All right. And then what's the derivative of that? dw is going to be negative sine x. Well, dw is going to be negative cosine x. I like what you said the first time. Yeah. Since I mean, you chose a couple different w's, but the w you told me now cosine. Yeah. The derivative of that is negative sine x dx. You cool with that? Yeah. All right. So now we're just going to do our substitution. Um, is really what? W. Okay. So let's make that w. And then I have sine x dx. Ooh, I usually change colors on that, right? So you can see the That's color code. It's w, but it's negative, so you would put negative dw in the numerator. OK. Um, and you want the negative to be inside or outside? Uh, it doesn't matter to me. I'll just put it outside if you're cool with that. Um, and some people kind of freak out when they see that, so they make it um, 1 over w dw. Because my guess is everybody knows what this is, right? Mm -hmm. What's the antiderivative of that? It's going to be negative natural log cosine x. Okay, so cosine x is your w, right? Yeah. Um, in absolute value plus c. Now that is your answer, right? Mm -hmm. That's got to blow your mind, right? You start out with tangent, which is like the strange little trig thing, and then you end up with natural log, which is the strange little like two algebra trig thing. That's crazy, right? Yeah. But you would take the antiderivative of tangent and end up with that crazy thing. Anything you want to say about that? <laughs> no. Nope. You want to say goodbye to your audience? <laughs> goodbye, universe. Wow. All right. So how many how many uh, likes do you think we're gonna? Oops, I should have hit stop first. Isn't. <laughs>